try to fix my light. So, I need to, I'm sorry, I am not, I'm not set up. I should have probably been set up, but what we are going to do is something that I have promised you guys in the past and I will deliver. So we are going to be comparing the Elemis Pro Collagen Cleansing Balm and this is my luxury item with the Pig Nose Clear Blackhead. So this is supposed to be a, hold on, it is a oil balm and I just got this. I had done my initial video back in March. It is now April. So it's been a hot minute. That works. Okay, so I received this in the mail. I bought this off of Amazon. I love it. It's super cute. But it was $10. So, <laughs> so this is my affordable brand. And this is what, wow, there's even less product than I initially thought. Uh, so is this really the affordable one? I mean, honestly, this is pretty great for traveling. I'm, I'm honestly just gonna use this regardless whether I like it or not. Because it's great packaging for traveling. I should probably say that at the end. Like, we do things differently around this place. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I am going to compare the luxury item versus the affordable. So this is the Pro Collagen and this is the Pignos. And we're just gonna see which one's better. So it's gonna be very controlled again, so. I'm gonna dip my hand in here and it's been a while since I've actually used this cream specifically and I'm only gonna put it on the skin itself I'm not gonna use it for the lips or the eyes because I want to specifically see about the skin so I did a pretty generous amount for this one specifically and if you saw my last video you'll see that I did the pro collagen versus the take the day off by Clinique and you'll just see which one ended up being the better candidate the better of the two so okay so we're gonna do one two three one two three one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, so I'm gonna go again, wash my hands, and then I'll be right back. Okay, and I also brought the towel that I will be using for the other portion. So, right here we have our pig nose oil balm. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be a little difficult to get but it honestly just melted right in. So let's see. Oh, wow. Okay. I see you. Ooh, smells nice too. If you guys know, know me, <laughs> then you know that I really don't like smelly products and that even if it's a good scent, I don't like super strong fragrance. But this just, it's subtle enough to where I, I like it. And it's very oily. I love that. Okay. So. Ooh. Now everything's coming out. 
the true me is coming out. It's showing. Okay, so we're gonna do one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three. And then over here, I think that's the middle. And then we're just gonna use this side specifically for this one. Okay, and now we'll use the other side. The exact same thing that we did on my last video. Just to see what is up, what is good. Okay. So, oh. <laughs> see some oiliness up here already this one's dirty now we <laughs> um so here you have it my bare naked face and now we're gonna go with these bad boys the facial wipes this is the coconut oil and sea salt so we're gonna compare each side and I guess I'll just fold it in half since it's already nicely laid out for you this way. Regardless. Okay. And if you're interested in looking at a more medium range, um, budget go check out the video that i compare the pro collagen with the take the day off because that one was life-changing for me okay so i think i'm trying not to pull it my skin down or tug it especially right here i'm being very gentle when it comes to the eyes Okay, so this is what this looks like. And let's go to the next side. And that is the pig nose. I like the name though. It's very cute. Okay. It was very, it, I wouldn't even say it was buttery. It was very, whoa. Smooth, I don't even know, oily? <laughs> I think that's the word for it. So I think if you have um, dry skin, this is perfect for you. And plus it's the perfect travel size. Hi mama. Koba's awake. Okay. So, let's analyze this. Wow. So, this is what it looks like. At this point in time, I am just looking back and seeing how much this thing cost me. It was about $60. And yet this $10 bomb does a better job. I'm sure this one is more nourishing. It's more This powerful deep cleansing balm 
dissolves makeup, daily grime, and pollutes. Pollutes? Pollutes. That word. <laughs> and yet, yeah, take a look. Take a look, my friends. Take a nice long look. Pause it if you have to. I'm shook. Okay, so final verdict. Pig nose. Um, I mean, I'm still gonna finish this off because it was, it cost me a pretty penny. So, still gonna finish this off. But now that I've done that, I can make sure I use all of this up and then continue to buy different products. And I am honestly so glad that I did this because like I said in my last video, I am, I am the person that will buy something that is more expensive just because of the price. So this is kind of showing me that even though it's a luxury item, even though it's high priced, it's not the best product out there. There are other products that will, that are more cost effective and will do a better job. So I'm going to continue this series and my next one is going to be specifically the pig nose going head to head between the Clinique Take the Day Off. That one I have on my counter over there because I've been using it religiously ever since I found out. So I'm just really, really disappointed in my cream. And don't get me wrong, I still love it. I will not repurchase it, to be honest, because it has not shown. <laughs> it has not de demonstrated to me that it's the better of its kind. So I take away this challenge with new knowledge. So that's going to be it for today, guys. Thank you so much for staying tuned. And if you want to watch more videos like this, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button because I am going to be doing affordable, medium and luxury items. And we're going to put them head to head and see which ones are the true winners, which one is the master. So 